Freedom Arms 454 Casol field grade so that it has the uh, duller finish, doesn't have the high gloss finish it's for hunting. Costs the same either way, but it's just so you don't have as much shine out hunting. Uh, six inch barrel because six inches is the minimum length that you can take hunting in Utah, or was at the time. Uh, adjustable sights, made the grips myself, ivory micarta. Uh, it's your 454 Casol, 300, well the first round up is a 45 Colt cowboy load I call them, uh, about 250 grain bullets moving around 800 feet per second basically what the old cowboys used to shoot each other with. The rest of the rounds in it are 300 grains, uh, jacketed hollow points. We'll be moving out of that particular gun at about uh, 16, 1700 feet per second. Never have actually clocked it, uh, just estimate. Okay. And We'll show like, some of the rounds in a minute, but so I'm, I'm going to shoot a lighter load first and then a heavier load, right? It's only uh, holds five rounds, five being the proper number of rounds for a revolver. That puts your notch in between the chambers to make it a little stronger. Do they not flute these on purpose, or did you just ask for that? No, they, they're not fluted on purpose. For the extra safety? The chambers are line bored. In other words, they put the uh, cylinder in the gun and then drill the holes through the frame while it's locked up while it's locked up so that they are perfectly aligned okay and it's considered the best revolver ever made and uh, a real we're, handful we're, we're, a real joy to shoot with 45 colts and uh, <laughs> takes everything kind of to the limit with the uh, 454. There's been more powerful guns made, the 475 and the 500, but uh, they will eventually break down your wrist bones. Mm. Uh, Smith not... & Wesson made their 500, which is more powerful, but they also made a four and a half pound gun. Yeah, which I, is any idea much... what this weighs? It's not that heavy. This weighs three pounds, which is the same as a Super Black Hawk or, or a Red Hawk. So or... comparable to a Ruger? Yeah. Single action, so okay. it's so it's not like you're strapping a rifle on your hip, but but it's but it's pretty large. Okay, so I'm gonna take a couple of shots. He's got me a little worried about the console loads. I'm gonna step out on the snow. I'm gonna shoot at these pizza boxes. Get a good, good grip. Yeah. Yeah, that wasn't too bad. Yeah. But the next one will be bad. That's the 45 Colt, much like the 44 Specials you got for the 44. It's the same equivalent. Yeah, this one's going to be a little hotter. Now this is the 44 Magnum Plus. You're making me want to really get a grip on this thing. Yeah, you can feel that. <laughs> yeah. That'll slap your hands. You want to shoot a couple? Yeah. Okay, we're shooting the 454 Casol.